Hello guys, welcome back to another amazing video. So in this video, I'm going to be introducing you to this new crypto and gift card buying and selling platform. So if you want to go into the business of selling and selling of gift card and buying, selling and buying of crypto and gift cards, so this video is for you. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to set it all step by step, how to put it online and how to set everything from beginning to scratch for you. So as you can see now, this is the front um, page of the website. You can see it's well designed and very beautiful. So you can see trade online, trade on WhatsApp. So if you click that, it takes you back to your, to your, your WhatsApp. So I'll show you how to do that. So you can see how it works, where so shall have an account. Request uh, to sell or buy crypto or gift card and all that. See, and these are the testimonials and all that. So this is the home page. Basically, I see it's well designed and structured for you. So next thing I will do is to log into our account so you can see the dashboard. So I already have an account, so I'll just log in. If you don't have an account, you can just create your own account. So um okay, so I'm logging. All right. Um All right, so you can see now this is the user dashboard. I can see the design is very amazing. And see here, you can see buy gift card, sell gift card, buy crypto, sell crypto. And you can see your transactions, your profile, and support. You can see here, you can trade gift card and trade crypto. You can see your last ratio of um, 100, then last login IP, then last login date, and all that. So, so first thing first to try now is to buy crypto so click on buy crypto okay you can see there's different um cryptocurrency here so there's bitcoin there's bnb there's cardano there's dodge there's ethereum so for this now we'll just say okay we want to buy bitcoin click on buy and um see minimum of two dollar and the rate is actually one thousand seven hundred so all these can actually be controlled from the admin side. So I will show you guys how to do that in a bit. So um, let's say I want to buy um, $100 worth of um, Bitcoin. So that's $100. So you can see the uh, near equivalent of uh, 120,000. So that is because the rate is uh, 1,700. So uh, enter your um, Bitcoin address. Because I want to actually buy. So you need to enter your Bitcoin address so that it can send it to you. So I just enter a random um, address here. Then the comment of um, um, anything you want. So just put test there. Then click on proceed. Okay. Now this way I actually have to make a payment of. Um, Yeah, as you can see now, so you can say, please send only the sum of uh, 170,000 naira to the account number below. Do not send more or less than the amount. So you can see the account number here and all that. So this account number can actually be controlled from the admin side. So I'll actually show you guys how to um, change that. So and say ensure to take a screenshot and snapshot of the transaction confirmation page and send it to us for confirmation. So after making your transfer, you have to send like the screenshot proof of okay, you have sent the money and all that. So after that, you click on choose buy, then you upload the screenshot, then click on buy. Click on buy, then just wait for it to load. It says, says for your account to be created soon after verification. So after the um, payment has been verified, the crypto $100 worth of Bitcoin will be sent to your address you provided. That's that for that. So the next thing I have to do is to go to sell gift, sell gift card. And that. So the next thing I have to talk about is to click on um, sell crypto. Let's do. Let's test sell crypto. Is to test the sell crypto. Okay, it's actually the same process. So you have to choose the crypto you want to sell and all that. So for this, you still choose Bitcoin.
okay you can see the rate is still actually see what our 700 so they say like like please make sure to set your bank details before selling any coin so what this means is that you have to set your bank details on your profile before you can actually um sell any crypto so that your account can actually be credited so first thing i have to say want to sell um usd okay i'm not in usd you can say hundred dollar worth of bitcoin so you can see the equivalent here okay now rate what are seven guys okay that's 170,000. so your bank details this is it here you should you should set on your profile click on that and write a comment of okay so let's see test and click on submit so as you can see how easy it is to actually do this so you can say please send only please only send your point of this address below you can also just scan this you can just copy this here this copies your address here this address can actually be set from the admin side so you can copy that once you make payment just click on choose fair like your proof of payment see proof submitted so your money will be sent to your account after verification so after the verification of payments your money will be sent to the account number you set in your profile on that so basically that is how the selling of crypto and buying of crypto actually works so the next thing not to try out is the buy gift card so let's come buy gift card here so you can see these are all the gift card on the side so there's amazon canada amazon uk amazon usa there's um apple itunes car ebay and all that there's google so for this um we just choose anyone let's say we're going for amazon uk we want to buy amazon uk card so click on that and say buy gift card instantly so i might want to buy say i want to buy like ten dollar ten dollar so you can see the conversion rate of phone error so this phone error can actually be um added can actually be changed from the admin side so you can, you can actually set the rate you want to be selling amazon uk card and buying of amazon uk card so let's say for this is phone error so just click click on buy so you please send only the sum of four Nearer to the account number below, so this is the account number. And you also submit your proof of payment. You can see how very easy and straight to the point. All right, so submit this and click on buy. See, so your gift card will be sent to you after verification of payment. So that's that. So next thing now is to try the sell of gift cards. I want to sell my gift card, so click that. Try to choose the one you want to sell. So for this, let's say go for eBay. Okay, enter the amount. So please make sure to set your bank details. So at least actually the same process for selling of uh, crypto and selling of gift cards. So you have to set your bank account so that you they can actually know. Um, the account you they want to send your payment to so for this send ten dollar then upload gift card image that's my gift card image if i have if you have that then put the no number then this is my bank yes you can just choose that then cover conversion rate is 12 naira you can also see edit this on the admin side so click on save After verification, the amount will be sent to you successful, and that is it. So that is all about buying and the selling of um, gift card and crypto. See, very easy and straight to the points. So next thing now to try is nice our transactions. So you click on transactions here, you can see all the transactions you have made on this site. You can see um, this is the amount ten dollar sold gift card. This date, keep processing, everything is processing. You click on next page, you can see all the transactions I've actually made here. You can also print it out and download it for yourself. Then that's all that about that. So next now you click on profile. Profile now this way you set your account details for payment. So you can see you can also see update your profile picture, then set your account number here, account name and your bank name. Then you can also see change your password, your account password. So you can put your old password, then put your new password and click on change password. The next thing is to click on support. 
support and see contact us via whatsapp without any issue this is your whatsapp number and this our uh, email so that is that for that so basically this is how the user side works as you can see very easy and straight to the point so the next thing now is to log into the admin side and see how the admin can actually have full access i can control the site all right so let me log into the admin side um total balance so total money they are from bought and sold all together so this is users so you click on users you can see the total users on this platform right now you can see this is all the users and you can click on view click on view let's see you can see the account id email the username you can also delete this user and also edit yeah, email. Okay, you can edit your email. Then you can also upload profile. You can also change your profile picture for them. All right, so you can see here penny transactions. You can see the penny crypto transactions and the penny gift transactions. So all the transactions are actually been made by users. So first, now let's try the pending crypto transactions. Okay, let's see. You can see um, set crypto. So let's this click on this. So this is actually so the crypto. Okay, so you type crypto, user email, the amount and everything, then this is the account number and this. So you can update the status to accept when you are sending the money to the user, or you can also see decline or delete the transaction. Anyone you want to do. So that basically that is how that works. So the next one is to try now is the penny gift card. Okay, penny gift card, see this here. So click on this. This user actually bought a gift card, so you can see transaction number and all that amounts hundred. Um, the conversion rates, okay. Uh, so email to send gift card to. So after you've gotten gift card, you send the gift card to this um, user email. You can also see accept, decline, also delete. So this is actually the transaction proof. Yeah, you can just click it and it's open there. So basically, that is how that works. So the next thing I have to do is to add coins and add gift card. So click on add gift card. So yeah, you can see all the gift card on this platform right now. You can also see edit and change everything. Yeah, so okay, let's see. I want to edit this team Netherlands. So click on edit. So you can change this, change the type. You can also see um, make this one inactive. So if it's inactive, it's not really show in the um, user side. So that's that. So yeah, this way you are the um, conversion rates. So basically, for Amazon gift card, it was four naira. So let me, it was four naira. So you can just come here and this to the price you want to sell it. Okay, let's say I want to sell it for uh, one thousand. So click on update add gift card click on add gift card so you can put the type so these are all the types so you have a nike itunes google ebay apple amazon and all that so you can add the gift card name and the image and your rates that is that for that so next one is to click on add coins so you can add more cryptocurrency there's already bitcoin there's bitcoin there's a uh, Dodge, there's a uh, Ripple, there's Solana, there's a um, BNB, there's Tron. So yeah, you can also see I did the address. Users can make payments too. So this is it. You can edit this address here. Then you can also see make this uh, inactive. So if it's inactive, users can actually buy uh, Bitcoin. And also you can also see delete it here. So basically this is how it works. And also you can also see add your own coins here. And say your coin name, the coin address, so users can make payments. So in case they want to buy, then coin image, then click on add wallets, add coin. So that is that for that. So and also you can come here, click on settings, click on profile. You can actually edit the um, users uh, the admin profile. So you can change your email. You can also see change your image then you can also come down here to change your password so you have to put your old password and put your new password and confirm it click on change password so that is that for that so 
click on settings now click on settings click on settings you can actually edit the site name the about us your bank number bank email they can also come in and have it as your live charts and you can also set the dollar rate so dollar rate is actually set to one seven as i showed you guys earlier before so I'll do this to two thousand to three thousand to one thousand any amount you want so the minimum crypto you can buy i did this to ten dollar twenty dollar as minimum i see also she did the maximum amount you can also see buy so for this is your account number where users want to um buy want to say um buy or say their gift card so this is your account number users will pay to and after that you can click on save basically this is how this website works so next thing to show you guys now how to set it up for yourself and for your clients so let's get started now so we have to log into your once you get your domain mouse in um log into your cpanel okay once you log into your cpanel bring to this dashboard click on files Time manager. Click on um public underscore HTML. For this money is actually inside the folder because this is just a test for test purpose. Then once you have uploaded your file here, then click on extract. You should see all these files here like this. So they are placed in the subdomain, or placed in the folder, or placed in the main domain it will still work so want to set up click on this installation guide click on view you actually see the step on how to set up easily so first thing first to download and extract the zip file to your public directory or subfolder or subdomain create a database and import the db dot database dot file inside the database folder so this is the database folder here database folder click on that on database so we'll click the total this once you have created your um database just import this in your php my admin so after that go to, to set up SNTP, locate the folder and then user class include folder the user class so this is what i'm talking about go back here include folder it's include folder then user class, click on that, click on edit. Scroll down a little bit, and you see here, this is where you're gonna set up your your SNTP details so that users can actually receive mail in the site. All right, so that's that. And also to set up, um, to replace this number here, yeah, let me open that real quick. Um, and also to edit this number here, trade on WhatsApp. So if you click on that, it will take you to your WhatsApp number. So let me show you how to actually edit that. So go back here, click on the installation guide. You see, go to index.html line 20, one, line 120 and remove the number without there. Okay, uh, index.html. Let's go back here. Go back. index sc click on that click on edit line 120 all right this is it so this here just put your number yeah so just remove all this here then put your number without zero just put your number here the whatsapp number here and that is that so that is that for this video um as you can see it's very easy to set up so thanks for watching and see you in my next video bye for now